the new O57 are the best Manfrotto Pro tripods, designed to offer the best performance of stability and precision to the keen amateur and pro user. Developed with the most modern technologies, it features the best materials and technical solutions available in the Manfrotto collection. Open the three tripod legs. To adjust the height of the tripod, each leg has telescopic extensions that can be released by opening the lever on the locking collar. When the required height is achieved, lock the lever. The tripod is supplied with a spirit level to help you level the tripod. Each leg can be set at three spreads. To change the angle on the leg, close the leg towards the center slightly. Press the button to select the new leg angle, then open the leg. The tripod has rubber feet with retractable spikes for external use. To use the spiked feet, rotate the rubber ring clockwise. Geared versions the geared mechanism allows you to precisely set the column extension, providing maximum accuracy in setting the camera position. To set the column height, unlock the center column, lift the handle and adjust the height by rotating it. Once you have reached the desired height, lock the column by tightening and locking the knob. The tripod incorporates a grub that allows you to adjust the friction of the column movement. The tripod can be used for very low angle shots when used without the center column. Loosen screw with a screwdriver. Unscrew the top plate by hand. Unscrew the column end by hand. Remove column by turning the handle. Put top plate on the tripod. Aligning part with opening, then completely fix the column end to the underside of top plate, screwing them together by hand. Close the leg extension and set the leg angles at the lowest position to achieve floor level. In order to reassemble the center column, proceed as follows. Remove top plate and column end from the tripod. Align gear column with the handle from above the tripod. Press with one hand the gear column downwards and rotate the handle clockwise. Lock the column in position with the locking knob. Reassemble the top plate on the center column by rotating it clockwise. Screw the column end back into the bottom of the center column. Rapid column versions. The rapid column versions allows you to quickly change the position of the camera by adjusting the column height. To release the center column, unlock the knob and adjust the height of the column as required. Tighten the knob to lock the column in position. To reach ground level positions, loosen the screw with a screwdriver. Unscrew the top plate by hand. Unscrew the column end by hand. Unlock knob. Remove the column. Put the top plate in the tripod aligning the part with opening, then completely fix at the column end to the underside of the top plate, screwing them together by hand. Set the leg angles at the lowest point to achieve floor level. To mount the camera head on the top plate, use the 3 8 of an inch fixing screw. Tighten the three set screws up against the base of the head, taking care not to force them. If the telescopic leg extensions slip, even after having tightened the locking lever, the locking tension will need to be adjusted. In order to do this, release the lock lever. Turn the screw clockwise using the special key provided on one of the tripod legs. Normally, a third of a turn will be sufficient to achieve the correct locking tension.